morning, good morning. Let us look at how we can overcome pride. We spoke a lot about pride, how God feels about it, the root of it, the symptoms, the strife that's fettered to it. Let us look at the most important part. How can we overcome? Because there's no point in having all of this knowledge about pride and what it does and where it comes from and all of that and then not seeking to overcome. God has given us this information so that we can overcome pride. And so we are going to James chapter 4 verses 7 and 8. So then surrender to God. Stand up to the devil and resist him, and he will flee in agony. Move your heart closer and closer to God, and he will come even closer to you. But make sure you cleanse your life, you sinners, and keep your heart pure and stop doubting. This is how we can overcome pride. Surrender to God. Yield to God, to his will, to his plan, to his ways, to his principles, his precepts, to his commands, to his purpose. Yield your life completely and consistently to God. When we do that, pride will have no place in our lives at all all and as we yield to god we can resist the enemy the enemy that is bringing prideful behaviors and ambitions to us it is only when we surrender to god that we can gain this grace and the strength that we need in order to resist the enemy and as we move closer and closer to God, he is purifying our lives and sanctifying us more. He's coming close to us. We're coming close to him. And it's a process, this sanctification. It continues throughout our lives until the day Jesus comes back or until we leave the earth. So we move closer to God on a daily basis, closer and closer. And he's going to show us those pockets of pride. He's going to cleanse us. He's going to purify us. He's going to draw us closer to him. And eventually, we will have a pure heart as it relates to pride. That initial surrender to God is obviously salvation. If you have not given your life to the Lord Jesus Christ, that's the first step, salvation. Because surrender to God, resist the devil, and he will flee. Draw close to God and he will draw close to you and make sure that you cleanse your life, cleanse your heart, have a pure heart towards God and have absolutely faith in him. And we will be able to overcome pride one step at a time. May the Lord bless you.